Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullah. Uh, morning. So uh, we meet again in our class uh, online asynchronous for data communication B four two double three. So today we will discuss uh, chapter two. Still uh, in the mode of uh, data. Uh, introduction to data communication okay uh, thank you for our uh, instructor mr mama isham for his uh, copy of the notes okay so this uh, chapter uh, cover uh, the sub chapter 2.1 until 2.6 Data communication system. Uh, data communication networking and internet. Okay. Um, OSI and TCP IP protocols and standard. Data decoding and encoding. Multiplexing and demultiplexing. Uh, I think, uh, I believe that some of you have still remember or have heard about this uh, decoding and uh, decoding and encoding, multiplexing and demultiplexing. This topic has been covered in um, principal communication subject. Eh? And then uh, we will discuss about data switching principle and reliability. Okay. Um. Okay, data communication system. Data communications, the terms telecommunication means communication at a distance. The word data refers to information presented in whatever form is agreed upon by the parties creating and using the data. Data communications are the exchange of data between two devices via some form of transmission medium such as wire, cable, um, optical fiber, wireless and so on and so forth. Okay, let me change. Okay, um, okay, then, <clears throat> uh, fundamental characteristic of the data communication. The effectiveness of the data communication system de depend on four fundamental characteristics. Okay. Four fundamental characteristics. Uh, first, delivery. Second, accuracy. Third is timeliness. Yes, huh? And four is jitter. So what are those? There are five components of data communications. Okay. First is message. Okay. 
this is the message the information okay this is the message the information second is the sender okay sender the first party sending the uh, information the third is the receiver the receiver party second party okay the fourth a component is the medium of communication okay medium of communication so this is the medium the medium also known as channel okay channel of communication and number five is protocol the protocol or the standard okay uh, next is about direction of data flow first is known as simplex second is known as half duplex and third is known as full duplex for simplex there are uh, the direction of data only uh, one way okay so there is a single direction of data flow for half duplex um, the direction of data can be uh, two way however uh, only one direction can operate at one time for full duplex the direction of data is two-way and it can be op operated simultaneously or uh, alternately oh, sorry um, at any time right? it can operate at any time anyway any direction of the uh, flow <coughs> <coughs> okay next subtopic <coughs> next subtopic is data communication networking and internet network issues first is network criteria performance reliability and security okay in terms of the performance uh, the throughput or the output and the delay is is importance in terms of reliability data transmitted are identical to data received measured by the frequency of failure and the time it takes a link to recover from the failure in terms of the security it is important to protect the data from unauthorized access okay next is some terminology the throughput or bandwidth of a channel is the number of bits it can transfer it can transfer per second so uh, throughput means number of bits it can transfer per second through the channel latency or delay of a channel is the time that elapses between sending information and the earliest possible reception of it between the the time taken to send the information Okay, so uh, it it is defined as the times elapsed from sending information and rec receiving of the information at the receiver. Then next is network topologies. Topology defines the way hosts are connected to the network. Okay, so. Network topology issues. A goal of any topology is first is high throughput or high bandwidth, and the second is low latency. Okay, high bandwidth and low low um, time taken. Okay. The fast lah meaning meaning this sending very fast. Bandwidth and latency. Bandwidth telecommunication range of radio frequencies. A range of radio frequencies used in radio or telecommunication transmission and reception. 
computing communications capacity the capacity of a communication channel for example a connection to the internet often measured in bit per second okay bit per second a data transmission rate the maximum amount of information bit per second can be transmitted along a channel latency latency is syn synonymous to same meaning for delay is an expression of, of how much time it takes for transmission from one designated point to another from one uh, transmitter to the receiver also can okay next is the topology yeah? so the categories of topology we have discussed previously there are four main topology and you have another one okay first is mesh second is star third is bus ring uh, fourth is the ring topology so mesh star bus and ring so what is the fifth We have discussed this before. What is the face? Okay. You give you you let me know. <coughs> Mostly used network topologies. So this is mesh topologies. This is star topology. This is bus topology. And this is ring topology. Ring, yeah. So normally ring is uh or circle. <laughs> in this case uh, look like a square but it is a ring topology okay number five is hybrid topology a hybrid topology so this is example of hybrid topology where a star backbone with three bus network so you have this star and uh, this is the bus this uh, connection with the hub is known as star right so star you have the hub so here this is the hybrid uh, combination of star and buses okay what's the internet nuts and both view millions of connected computing devices okay so uh, you have a smartphone laptops server and pc millions of connected computing devices Host and systems running network apps. Okay, then you have a communication link, fiber, copper, radio link, satellite. Okay, you have a fiber optic, uh, wire, copper wire, radio, normally we call it wireless, and also satellite. Okay, uh, both. All these uh, communication link have different transmission rate, have different bandwidth capability. Okay, next is uh, router. Packet switches forward packets, chunks of data, routers and switches. So this is uh, the view of the internet. So you have uh, you have mobile network and you have uh, routers global isp and then you have a uh, home network and also a uh, home network connected to the regional isp isp is internet service provider so you also has uh, institutional network like uh, lan or wan lan or wan okay so all these connected to the router okay 
Okay uh, Fund internet appliances Ini ya panggil at the, at the moment we know this as IOT lah Internet of things So you have IP picture frame Wet enable cost toaster and weather forecaster uh, tweet award monitor energy use internet phone and so on and so forth example only eh? so now now we have uh, more more devices connected to the internet known as internet of things so internet network of networks Interconnected ISPs Interconnected of ISPs Okay Protocol control sending receiving of messages Such as TCP, IP, HTTP, Skype And so on Internet standards You have RFC IETF RFC means request for comments IETF Internet Engineering Task Force Okay, so this is an uh, overview of internet. Infrastructure that provides service to ap applications such as web, VOIP, voice over internet, email, games, e-commerce, social network and so on. Provides programming interface to apps, hooks that allow sending and receiving app programs to connect to internet. Provide service options analogous to postal service. Okay. Okay. So that's all for our first subtopic in this uh, chapter. Uh, until then, we we'll stop here and we will meet again in another video. So that's all. Thank you very much for joining this class. Hope uh, for your hope for your best. Uh, so, hope, hope for all the best for you, all of you. So until then, that's all. Thank you very much. Bye bye.